Hello everybody, it's Hogan Rules, and today I'm going to talk about my WWE Raw reaction. You're probably wondering about this. That's just as it that kept bleeding, bleeding, bleeding. If you ever get those, leave them below because they suck. They really suck. I'm going on Nova, uh, sh No Shave November, but we're going to get to my WWE Raw reaction. The other stuff will be in another video. So, here we go. Um, your reason why my hair is all messed up, the reason is that, yeah, gym, school, and everything messes it up. It gets all frenzy. I put wire and wall it down, so you know I'm a little bit sweaty. I'm at swim practice tonight, but, um, 8 to 9 30. But first, we're going to get to my WWE Raw reaction. Forget all this stuff. Um, if I talk too fast, leave in the comments below. Uh, sorry. Hmm. And then, okay, what happened first was the Undertaker Kane came out, right? And the Druids are out there. Undertaker Kane talking about, we are the true darkness of our events and your depths of hell and something like that. And then here comes Bray Wyatt, Luke Harper, Braun Strowman, Eric Rowan come out. And Bray looks like, here's the thunder. And then my, your druids are mine. He said something like that. And the druids come with sheet mask, white sheet mask. Start attacking the, the Brothers of Destruction side is a little bit mute because I'm a little bit sick. Um, start attacking the Brothers of Destruction. And the Brothers of Destruction, like, double choke slam, will choke slam two druids. Not at once, but Kane has one, and then Undertaker has another. Kane chokes out in one, like, really low, but Undertaker chokes him way, really high. Could have broke his neck. Ow, dude. Those are probably the referees or j, &J Security or some little dudes that work there with staff or something. Well, they paid the price. <laughs> that sucks. Um, So, they're the true face of darkness. Bray Wyatt, Luke Harper, Eric Rowe, and Braun Strowman are not. And he's well, Bray Wyatt's got his walking chair by by the way back. So moving on, that was pretty awesome. I love how that se that segment went. They should have at the end though, but the beginning. All right, but this is Undertake Week on the WWE Network. If you're watching this, Undertake Week whole week long, because Sunday at Survivor Series from 1990 to now 2015, 25 years of destruction. The Undertaker, but the, the Demon Kane is with him. So the Brother of Destruction in real life, they're cousins, but they're the Brother of Destruction in WWE. Um. So this WWE World Heavyweight Title um, tournament, we have Dean Ambrose versus Dolph Ziggler. Dean Ambrose won, which is pretty cool because I thought Dolph Ziggler would win, but Dean Ambrose won because he's like coming up and coming But I was like Ziggler and Dean Ambrose. I don't care which one win. They're both good guys. But then Dean Ambrose won. I was like, Yay, Lunatic fri Fringe. Well, Michael said Lunatic Fridge. It's Lunatic Fringe. Okay, Michael, get it right. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We are all humans. We all mess up at points. Um, so do I. And you can't lie. You have to. We're not all perfect. We never were. We never. We're just here to learn from our snakes and then make them better, right? Learn from them and then improve on things. Yep. That's why we. That's what we do. And then what happened is that um, Kevin Owens first um, who did he face? Neville and Kevin Owens won. That was a pretty awesome match. Back to back. I knew the Intercontinental Champion was going to win because he's a champion. Kevin Owens wins. Kevin Owens versus Dean Arrows in the semifinals. And then we had Cesaro versus Roman Reigns. And Cesaro versus Roman Reigns was an epic match. It went back and forth. And it was pretty cool. And then Roman Reigns ended up winning. Speared him 1, 2, 3. That was pretty cool. I knew Roman Reigns was going to win because he's supposed to win this whole tournament. Oh, spoiler alert. Sorry. But if he doesn't, then it'll surprise me. I don't know who. I'm going to go with Dean Arrows or Roman Reigns to win this at the end. Or Dean Arrows Potato or Roman Reigns Potato heel turn or whatnot, not heel turn or something going to happen with Triple H and interference or something. Um, then we had uh, Brother Rio versus Kalisto. I was surprised that Kalisto beat Ryback. I'm not so surprised Brother Rio won his match against, um, who was it? Some person. I don't remember. Leave the comments below. Um... So, Alberto Rio is facing Kalisto, and Kalisto ends up losing. I knew he was going to lose, because Alberto Rio meet the court case and gets to run his own destiny. But, sure, Roman Reigns is going to win the next match, hopefully. Because I don't want Alberto Rio to win. Um, so, the United States Champion wins, gets to continue on. Still, like, he's going to get destiny and become the second man only to hold the WWE United States Championship and the WWE World Championship at the same time. Um, like Seth Rollins did, but he's injured. And he had successful surgery, but it'll be out six to nine months, so that sucks. And his knee injury about two weeks ago in a double iron or something over there in the match or an off brand match, which is dumb. You should have seen how he bent his knee either. But someone died. Nikola Bakalin, he died. He was eight, he died at passed away at age 80. He was the AW champion. 
he was an awesome person that they said. I mean, I never knew the guy, but dude, I hate when someone dies that they know, but people die. We're not going to live forever. We live once, so you got to live life to the fullest. And uh, we also, well, moving on from that, paying my respects. Also, in the beginning, they're paying respects to Paris and the terrorist attacks. Sad. They said one of our Americans died, but man, I was quiet for most of the part. My brother kept talking to me, though. Man, uh, I'm just really upset about that, man. And, yeah, I don't really want to get deep into this because it's YouTube. Anyone can see this. I don't really get deep into this, but I'm going to pay respect to that. I'm an American. Are you an American? Um, leave comments below if you're not, but, um, if you're not, but you still respect us, like I respect you guys, um, have fun with, uh, just, um, live life to the fullest, man. Don't worry about dying. Just work, don't, just, um, just try to live life to the fullest and don't think of that stuff. So I'm gonna move on to my raw reaction video sorry about getting a little deep, deep there guys um so we're we're going we have and triple h is talking to a bunch of other dudes um uh talking to a bunch of other dudes around a like he's talking about to the cesaro so they're lost he was talking about the real which he won um he was talking to kevin owens which he won his match he's trying to find a guy that will become the man his man, so he can have someone of options because Seth Rollins is injured and stuff, six to nine months out. I'm um, trying to find a person to replace him for right now. Or, yeah. I don't know who he's going to pick, but if he does pick, I hope it's not going to be good. Cause I hope it's uh, hope it's someone that's going to lose this in this tournament. Um, so, here's the semifinals. Dean Ambrose versus Kevin Owens and Roman Reigns versus Alberto Rio. <laughs> Who well, I think I'm gonna win that match? I'll leave it at my W Survivor Series prediction video because that's when it's supposed to happen. Yeah, but then they're gonna have something on SmackDown on Miz TV. Uh, Kevin Owens, Dean Ambrose, Roman Reigns, and uh, Berto de Rio uh, are supposed to be there. It's gonna be a tag team match ending up as the main event of SmackDown. Just saying, that's what's gonna happen. I mean, you know, yeah. But then we had the New Day, Cole Kingston, Big E, um, and, um, and Xavier Woods versus, he has a tromboner, trombone, I'm sorry, um, versus, uh, who they verse? I forget who they verse, but I think they won. Uh, I don't know, they didn't win. Ryback versus Jimmy and Jey Uso, the Usos. Um, they didn't win, but Ryback got involved and got it ended in a draw, so or disqualification, whatever it was, and then they beat the crap out of him, and then then Jay and Jimmy Uso and Ryback were uh, like all on top, and this is supposed to lead to a Jay and Jimmy Uso versus the New Day for the WWE Tag Team Championship. What am I gonna do with Ryback? Probably gonna push him to the side like nothing, like race. But then we had Dudley Boys, uh, um, Bubba Ray and Devon. Bubba Ray. Uh, and Devon versus the Ascension, Victor and Connor, and then the Ascension lost, of course. Um, Bubba Ray and Devon did the 3D, 1, 2, 3. Bubba Ray got the pin, and Devon was holding on to see if anyone would come out. Like, yeah. And then they, what I'm talking about, holy, I was like Connor on the outside. Um, but uh, Victor lost. I, I don't know if Victor is Adam Rose, can you leave the comments below, but I don't think he is. Um, yeah, but that match was really pointless. And then we had the World Wire talked about the main event. It was pretty stupid. And Brother Rio was excluded. I knew Brother Rio was win, so I was like, that's a pointless match. I mean, it's not pointless, but it kind of was because you knew who was going to win. If you didn't, good for you. You had a great match. Good. Um, then we had the contract signing, Paige or, and Charlotte. And then Charlotte got deep into her brother. Uh, that stuff, oh my god, and then Paige made fun of her for it, Paige signed it, but Charlotte didn't, and then Charlotte starts beating up Paige, um, it went over overtime, so I recorded another show, eh, something knows best, Ch Chelsea knows best, or something, whatever that dude is, he made a bit he's gay, I think, I don't know, it leave goes below, um, that's not even raw, but, uh, it went into that, and Charlotte started beating the crap out of her, and Paige got away, and then, 
Harper sounds like there's the druids, and they were the druids basically, and JJ or some other staff people or something like that. Um, yeah. Uh, this was pretty a solid raw, except for like the two of the pointless match. Well, one pointless match. Um, because I don't know where they're going with the Dudley Boys. I don't know what they're gonna do with them because they're not gonna attack the titles. What are they gonna do? Nothing. They said they're gonna do nothing. We're Stardust. What the heck? What happened to that feud? Oh yeah, they were titles in the well, Neville got eliminated, so what about that? Um, Miz got eliminated also, so he's doing Miz TV with that. That's going to be the tag team match of Kevin Owens and Bertha Rio versus Dean Ambrose and Roman Reigns in the main event of WWE SmackDown. And, yeah. Um, so I'm going to get out of here, guys. That was mostly all of Raw, basically. We didn't even see where they ate along once, I think. I think not. Did we? Leave the comments below. Um, and I think that was all that was on Raw. WWE Monday Night Raw. If I forgot some things, I'm sorry. Um... But if I forgot a Divas match, just tell me. Uh, leave a comment below what I forgot, and I will read it later. And please like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe for more. Hogan rules out. Bye, guys.